Wow, that's pretty. That's that you could hear it in the music that you were feeling uh, emotional for sure. A lot of a lot of stuff going on with that guitar riff. Did you write that on the guitar? Yes. Yeah, you know how could you tell? I mean, you obviously yeah <laughs> that that riff. It, it's a wild riff, but it's so pretty, isn't it? I mean, yeah. It it and it's for it's it's kind of something that for the depression of it, but it, it's upbeat in some ways. But it, it's it's a bittersweet song, you know. Before we go on to the next uh, the next song, if people want to hear your music and follow you, how they can how can they do that? Right now, the the main thing to do is to go on to any well, first of all, any streaming station around the world. Um, I use DistroKid, which is, is such a great tool, and I'm bringing that up with you for other musicians that will hear this. That and, and you know, Kid Rock uses DistroKid now. You know, I, I on the last couple of singles he had, he was using it. I've been using DistroKid for two and a half years now. Now, what what is that? What is that for people it's, who don't it's know? It's a distribution company that is helps you keep your royalties. It doesn't, you know, in, in most aspects, you don't get paid a ton. But since Napster started stuff, that's why all the musicians were fighting. You know, I mean, if you're getting paid a penny per song, which is, you know, you got to get millions of songs played to make some money. And I'm sure you can negotiate after once you're as big as Kid Rock is, you know. But for me, I, I started off as Alex Sands, which um, I don't, or I'm, actually I wore this today just because we, we met here at the John O'Leary thing. And yeah. um, I kind of lost my train of thought there. The Okay, so at, I was using Alex Sands. Before I, before I went full throttle back to Holland Finch, I was just doing Alex Sands because I didn't really anticipate things to go the way they're going. You know, Holland Finch really gained momentum after the John O'Leary thing. I was I was doing Alex Sands right. sharing music because of my love for it. Um, so up until that point of the John O'Leary memorial and the song I wrote, the soul of John O'Leary, I was going as Alex Sands. So I got about 13 right. really cool songs on, and, and I, I think they're very cool because being a musician, they're fun to play. So if you're a musician, I know you're going to like right. them because they're fun. And they right. they, they, they grab you. But the uh, bottom line is listen to Alex Sands on any streaming station for the pre-Holland Finch. And then Holland Finch now on any streaming station has, I think, five, maybe se- um, maybe even seven songs now that I have released. Because I think I did a song, Prayer for You, Ukraine, Psychopathic Way to yes. Go. So, you know, you can listen to either one of those. If you want to catch the earlier stuff, then go to the Alex Sands. And then hopefully you'll go right on to the Holland Finch, which... You know, yeah. any Finch, Spotify, yeah. Deezer, if you're, you know, I got a pretty decent little following going on in Russia and Ukraine because of the prayer for Ukraine. Um, but all around the world, you can listen on any streaming station. And there's always a good thing to go to YouTube. It's always easy to load up there. So Another another song that I really took a liking to, and just because it's it's something that <laughs> used to be thrown around is, is kind of a, a little antidote, but it's uh, Snitches Get Stitches. Talk oh, about this tune. Man, that song is so cool. <laughs> you know, Holland Finch is, I'm, I'm not a normal guy. I'm a good guy. I'm a spiritual guy, but I love having fun. And that song to me is just fun. I mean, it is yeah. hammered down, and you hear people say the snitches get stitches, and it's, it's funny, and there's no super ill heart meaning towards it but it's just hysterically just a fun song rocking fun 